combination, this week we're going to be working with the double sticks. And all we're going to do is put together some of the basic movements in a combination. And this is just to, it's not a standard combination, it's not one you need to specifically remember for the fight. But it does help you to be able to move from one movement to the next. So any combination drills, um, from a karate point of view, katas contain a lot of information within each movement in the kata. Whereas this combination isn't specifically intended to store information about the movement, doesn't have any specific strategies behind it. These you got from your basics. What you're doing now is just chaining them, them together to help you flow better while doing uh, your double stick exercises. So from here, we're going to start chambered over the right arm. And we're going to go under, over. Then from here we're going to go over, under, and strike and snap back. Then we're going to take the top arm, we're going to strike, rotate, strike to the same spot again, then under, bring around the head, under the arm, and then we go under, over. So we're going to continue only on one side, once you've got the blueprint, you can swap it around and you can start from the other side. So from here we do again, it's under, over, over, under, snap, strike, hit again, under, over the head, hit, under, over and ready. So from here we go one, that's part one, part two, part three, part four, we do it again, part one, part two, part three, part four, part one, part two, part three, part four, we go slowly again, part one, part two, part three, part four, one, two, three, Right, spend some time with that combination and then maybe even try it against the punching bag and just feel how you go from one movement to the next movement to another basic to the last basic and just have fun with it. Maybe make up your own combinations as well but try and form a chain that flows nicely together.